Kevin here from DIYDork.com. Today I want to show you a makeover I did over the weekend on two different dressers I picked up really cheap on Craigslist. Now these things were really ugly but they had great bones and they didn't need a lot of work. They turned out really awesome so check this out. Alright so check this out. Here's one of the dressers I'm going to do a quick flip on today. Picked it up off of Craigslist for only 40 bucks, which is a great deal for something like this. It's got that really cool, it's a boxy mid-century design, but uh, really interesting. And uh, it's missing some knobs, and it's pretty ugly overall. Really, really ugly finish, actually. And uh, I think I can actually do it pretty quick. This is the old type of finish that will sand off really quickly. So all I have to do is just sand, smooth it, prime, and paint it, and it's ready to go. The only issue with this one in particular is that the bottom here, it might be kind of hard to tell, but this veneer is starting to split and come off. So it's kind of a hokey way of doing it, but I think I'm just gonna cut right across and uh, peel all that off and then just smooth it back out with uh, either some wood or some Bondo or something like that. But anyway, the plan on this one is to just sand it, prime it, paint the body a dark gray. Then the three drawers here, I'm gonna hopefully be able to sand them down just to raw wood and then just finish them with some poly and put new knobs on there. And then the really cool drawers here with the little slats, I'm going to sand them smooth and then paint them a really nice fresh aqua color. And I think it'll turn out pretty cool. So now let me show you the other dresser I'm going to do. All right, and here is the second dresser. This one's actually in a lot better shape than the first one, but the color is really nasty. I don't know if I can get it on video, but it is like pea soup green. Really, really weird color. But like I said, it's in great shape. Probably the worst part is this little tiny divot right here. It looks like a fingerprint almost. If I can smooth that over with some Bondo. But the rest of it is just going to be a quick sand, prime, and paint. And also, I want to show you real quick. Check out the really cool legs. It's kind of floating on like a little pyramid base. Pretty interesting. All right, so with this one, the plan is going to be a little bit different. I want to do the entire body in white. And then I want to take all these drawers and sand this part down to wood and just refinish it. But then the center part with the ribs and the little handle here, I want to spray a nice medium gray. I think that should look pretty cool. So I'll get started on these and I'll show you what they look like when they're all finished. All right, so check it out. Here's the first one all finished. As you can see, you had a couple of change of plans here. Um, the outside is the dark gray, like I was going to do. And then the really cool, smaller, slotted uh, pieces over here are the light aqua. But when I sanded these drawers down to the uh, raw wood, the wood veneer was so thin that I was going through spots, so I ended up painting it a deep aqua. Also, I put on the new hardware here. I actually picked up at a junk shop for, I think, 25 cents a piece, which is pretty cheap. And uh, anyway, it turned out pretty awesome. I'll show you real quick the uh, edges here. Remember I told you it was all chipped off and everything? I just took my knife and I cut right across here and I peeled all that chipping veneer off and that's Bondo down there and you can't tell at all. I mean it looks perfectly smooth. So that turned out really awesome. So now I'll show you the other one how it turned out. Alright and check it out. Here is the second dresser. And it's pretty obvious that my original color scheme did not work out like I was planning on. So instead of white on the outside I decided to go with this creamy silvery gray color which is really cool. It's kind of in right now. And then the same thing where the drawers are painted white, I was going to sand down to raw wood and then uh, just clear coat them like the other dresser, but it was the same thing. The veneer was so thin that when I sanded it went through in spots. So I just painted those a uh, semi-gloss white. And then the little handle sections here with the ribs, which is really cool, I just painted that kind of medium gray. So this one turned out awesome as well. And really it's probably easier just to paint everything than to finish the wood, but a lot of times when you're flipping dressers like this, if it has any original wood features, it'll sell a little better. But anyway, they both turned out pretty awesome. It was a pretty cool little weekend furniture flip.